we may see around here before the week is over is a lot of white with more snow in the forecast later this week, tomorrow night into Thursday morning. Today it's just been a chilly March day with wintry mix of precipitation. You can see why. Our high today so far has only been 30 degrees. That occurred this afternoon. In fact, we're sitting right at around 30 degrees now. So we're at about the high for the day after a morning low of 23. And with those sort of temperatures, precipitation obviously causes icy patches. You want to be on the lookout for that uh, as temperatures are still in the upper 20s and low 30s all around the Beltway, down toward D.C. A little bit above freezing, Stevensville, Easton, Ridgely, Centerville now at 34, Millington up to 33. So slowly, temperatures are trying to climb. And as the night wears on, We'll see warmer air moving in from south and southwesterly direction. So the worst part of the weather conditions are right now with this uh, light mix of uh, sleet and some freezing rain in our area. But as the winds shift more to the south and southwest, milder temperatures will come in. And this wintry mix in the snow will push farther up into New England. Looks like Boston's going to get more snow. Now you can see that all the winds are turning more to the south. And that's why we do expect temperatures will be steady or slowly rising through the early evening hours, heading us. Uh, past midnight temperatures should actually get closer to 40 degrees by early tomorrow morning. So a little bit of a wintry mix early, then rain, a few icy patches early on, then rising temperatures. The lowest temperatures right now, 27 to 32 degrees. Now the Weather Service has a winter storm watch in effect for the next storm. Not for what's going on right now, but this is for the next storm. The watch means keep an eye on things for late Wednesday night into Thursday morning as the potential for some accumulating snows come our way. So tomorrow we get a break. This warm front will push into the area. Temperatures on the other side are in the 40s and 50s. We'll get a brief little warm up, but look at how sharp this cold front is. 43 Kansas City, 15 in Rapid City, below zero again up in central Canada. That cold will become in our area Wednesday night. Low pressure moving along the front means the potential for snow beginning late Wednesday night going into Thursday morning. Tomorrow, almost a spring like day. Showers around, could even be some thunder down in southern Maryland. Temperatures in the 40s to near 50 degrees, but that doesn't last long. The showers take us into, say, 10 or 11 o'clock Wednesday night. Then the cold air comes through, the rain mixes with or changes to snow. Looks like snow will be here for the Thursday morning rush hour and may linger into the early part of the Thursday afternoon rush hour. So several hours of snow. And if the storm stays on this track, you can see the potential here for several inches of snow by Thursday afternoon. That's what we're going to have to keep a very close eye on. It's early on. The pattern could change a bit, but right now it does look like we'll get several inches of snow. Cloudy, milder tomorrow. Enjoy the temperatures above freezing, 43 to 48. But the winds turn to the northwest, and that cold will start coming back into the picture tomorrow night. In western Maryland, a mixed bag of precipitation tomorrow. Snow and cold in the mountains on Thursday. A high temperature of just 18 here in March. Central Maryland, rain showers tomorrow, 45. That changes over to snow late Wednesday night into Thursday. And as you saw, we could get six inches or more of snow on Thursday morning. 46 on the eastern shore tomorrow, then 36 with the rain changing over to snow Thursday. And even at Ocean City on Thursday, as temperatures begin to fall, the rain is likely to change over to snow by the afternoon or evening hours. So our seven-day forecast, 45 tomorrow, which is actually a couple degrees cooler than normal. 35 snow likely on Thursday, 28 for the high Friday after a morning low of 10. Just real cold stuff for March on Friday and 12 degrees Saturday morning. And then we'll see temperatures over the weekend reach the low 40s each afternoon. Mm -mm.